Are we live? Can I do your intro? What's going on everyone? This is Herf Games here, coming in with another RuneScape video, sort of like a little update video. I'm actually recording this live right now as I'm going and doing some Obor kills, and you might be wondering, why is Herf Games doing some Obor kills? And I have a very perfectly good explanation for that. As you know, from my last video, I told everyone that I was basically going to start trying to go for a lot more collection log items on this, on this group Iron Man account here that we have started. I am basically just going for some awesome collection log tasks here, and I don't have the Hill Giant Club from Obor yet. So I'm gonna go, I'm trying to get that, but also this is kind of a two birds, one stone scenario that we have going on right now. Currently in the clan that I joined on RuneScape here called All the Homies, we have a bingo event going on right now. And if you have been frequenting onto the Twitch channel of mine, we've been trying to grind out a bunch of awesome stuff on the bingo table here. And it's been going pretty good so far. My group here that we've been working with has been doing awesome trying to gather a bunch of these tiles. This is currently where we're at with our bingo with our bingo game. We're not in first, we're not in last, but we're we're definitely staying we're definitely staying competitive with it. There's a big awesome GP prize pool available for the winner. And you know, it'd be really awesome if we were to win that. It'd be kind of cool. That's kind of what we're pushing for right now. I have 16 Obor kills, so I'm like like there was basically almost like a 10% chance of me being able to get a hell club uh, the hill, the hill giant club by now i don't really know if that math actually makes sense it does to me though so that's what i'm uh, i'm basing that off of i'm just not that 10 percent lucky which is whatever my goal right now is to try and get a bunch of hill giant keys while my hispor is growing and basically just doing that i set up a cannon at the hill at the, at the giant's den on karend obor is just about to just get destroyed that's all we're doing right now it's obor time but as we do some obor, not get hit by the stupid dude's club. Damn it. Mate, I don't think my Hispor is ready just yet. But then we're going to come back. We're going to go and do some more hill giants. We're going to get try and get some more keys. We're going to try and um, we're going to try and get this dang club and or compost bucket. Another update on the account, actually, whilst I keep rambling. I updated the POH a bunch. We actually, I actually did end up getting a, a freaking Pharaoh Scepter from, from Pyramid Plunder, which was pretty insane. I decided to freaking max out my pet area. Basic, it's basically maxed out. I gotta have my Tangle Root homie over here. Pet Rock boy, where did he escape? Did he escape again? Oh, he's just over here. He doesn't have his party hat on anymore, so he's not as hard to figure out where he's at. It, it's not as easy to figure out where he's at anymore. So that's cool. I have this portal nexus. I can only. I don't even have any portal things in there. I don't even have any teleports in there yet, just because I don't really feel like putting any in there yet. So we're gonna figure that out eventually. And then Barrow's Portal, that was for Diary, and then Lunar Isle Teleport. But we're, we're getting there, you know, we're getting there, we're figuring it out. Also, I peeped that Holy Grail right there, kind of cool. We've been chilling, I would say. We've been chilling, it's been chill. Um, I'm hoping to get a Greater Demon task here soon so that we can actually go and do some Zami. One, for this uh, nice little uh, Zimmer, uh, God Wars Dungeon weapon tile on the bingo, bingo sheet. But also, just because it's really fun to go and do some bossing with the boys. Hell yeah, we got this this freaking Zenite. That was cool. I'm gonna make that into a Ring of Suffering. Uh, going on some Zolra. Zolra is one of the bosses that I've been trying to do for a while now. It's been really tough for me to just figure out what in the world I'm supposed to be doing in that boss fight. I tried the Darune Light plug-in. It just makes my turns my mind into scrambled eggs. I don't know why, guys. It's fine. We're gonna figure it out eventually, though. It's nice that the first 50 kills are free uh, death costs to recover items so that's really nice because my scrub ass doesn't really know what the hell's going on when i'm fighting that big ass snake so i'm just trying i'm just trying to figure it out once we get that going it's going to be lots of money it's going to be really awesome upgrades for the account and i really just can't wait so hopefully that uh goes a little bit goes pretty smooth once the serpentine helms acquired we're going to vorkath because i don't want to waste a bunch of supplies trying to fight vorkath and suck at it so i would want to be more lucky than i am i feel like everyone that i've interacted with in this game has gotten stuff well below kc and i'm just getting left out i'm an at kc kind of runescape player okay but it's all we're good for bottom of the barrel you know at least i got fancy stuff at least at least i got fancy stuff during my uh clue scroll grind so that's always fun
All right. Well, I definitely didn't get the Giants Club, and yeah, that's a bummer. I also forgot to bring actual food the first time I went, so I literally burned a key going in with Karam Bwams on a free-to-play world not being able to heal, and I also went in on like 50 health, so it wasn't really all that great and very smart. So good PVMing skills there, Herf Gims. No, oh, no Giant Club, but that's fine. We'll go and grind more. Either way, let's take a look at the collection log items here. In terms of actual bossing that we've been doing, uh, like I said, Gauntlet, I've only gotten 10 kills in there. Not soon, not a whole lot, just because that grind kind of ended before, like as the bingo event started. I had to get some Giant Mole KC as well. If I got a pet super lucky doing that, that'd be kind of insane, but we're, we're mad chilling on that. Hespore has been done for a while, so we don't really care about that. However, we would like to see this become a four. We did do some KBD kills, I only got like seven. Of course, couldn't get lucky, but that's fine. Krill, like I said, I only got three of the KC when we went last time. Um, I actually don't have any Serechnus kills. I might have to change that. Skatizo. I'm trying to get some more Skatizo KC. I only have three. I've been getting super unlucky with this Dark Totems. It sucks. But hopefully I can get a Dark Totem pretty soon. If I could get an Onyx from that, honestly, that'd be sick. But the Skodos pet is kind of cool looking, and I want to get it. So we're going to get that eventually. Temporos. We're getting there. We have a lot of kills. Well, 61, probably not a whole lot, but I'm hoping to be able to get a dragon spear and the tome. A pet would be kind of cool too. Vorkath is going to be happening eventually. Winter Todd, I just need the pet. I've been wanting to get this pet for a while, so hopefully I can actually get it. I'm not actually 99 fire making yet, so that'll be really nice. Volcano, I'm at 50 KC. Actually, not too bad. It would be really cool to get a crystal, crystal tool or the volcano shard even, but I really want an uncut onyx. That would be awesome because, like I said, I want to make this Ring of Suffering. And an Onyx is kind of like the one thing that's stopping me from doing that. So hopefully we can make that happen. Zolra, been getting shit on by Zolra. So hopefully we can get a little bit better at that as well. But that's essentially all that really is for bossing right now. Clues. I've actually been starting to do a lot more clues. Every time I get a clue, I'm going to do a clue. I have a beginner one to do right now, actually. So I'm going to go and do that. But beginner, nine done with uh, one thing. I got the this ornament kit of the Ceredomen ornament kit six easy trails done two items from there we got this iron plate skirt g and we also got the super nice green elegant blouse gonna be looking fancy up in here you gotta keep the fashion scape going mediums we got nine done we have five out of 115 we got the adamant plate legs t wizard boots I actually got spooned those pretty early which is pretty sweet adamant cane purple elegant shirt and the gold elegant legs again fashion scape is at that maximum right now we have 22 hard clues completed i actually got a bunch of these during the vamp during the sim the sentinel grind trying to get a blood shard that i didn't get but that's fine armadil full helm armadil plate body we got the zamorak coif we got the red dehyde t tan cavalier you know fashion scape and we also got some nunchucks and some uh, magic compo so that's actually kind of cool elite treasures two completed zero items kind of blows either way i actually got really close to getting a master clue done but then at the very last step it told me i needed to make a, a rune med helm which i only have like 75 smithing so that definitely didn't happen no rares although 22 hearts completed no rares no rares no rares bunch of pages bunch of bless or one two blessings actually a bunch of these stupid fire lighters lunar teleport taiwani teleport charge per you know the all this stuff you know it's all all good all fun and games mini games i'm actually kind of working on these a piece, decent amount we got our full rogue finally that's control we only need a few more items i need the hard diaries i think or elite diaries or whatever completed to be able to get the elite void shades of morton haven't done it at all soul wars haven't done it at all temple trekking of course that's four out of four because we're sick tith farming or tithe however we pronounce it i've only gotten the, the recolors can but the next thing I'm going to try and get is, of course, the herb sack, because the herb sack is sick, and it'd be awesome during Slayer. Seed box, probably next, but I don't really care much about that, and then I'll probably just to get, get, I'll probably get the seed box last, just because I don't really care much about the seed box. Volcanic mine, haven't done it yet. I thought they were going to be adding the dragon pickaxe to it, and if they do, that would be kind of cool. Although I think when I was reading through it, it was going to be dropped as like a broken form. If that's true, I'm going to try and go and do it. Barbarian Assault. I haven't done this at all either. It would be really cool to get the Fighter Torso. This might have to happen eventually, but I'm super pushing it off because I kind of don't want to do it at the same time. Gotta get that Agility Arena ticket, you know? One out of eight for the Birmingham Agility Arena. F Giants Foundry, I only got the double ammo mold, so that's kind of what we're what we're working with. Gu Guardians of the Rift. This one we've been doing a lot. I haven't gotten shit, but we'll get there eventually. Sepulcher. This is one that I've been do enjoying a lot. Uh, basically got all of the drops up to the point that I can get right now. I'm only level 80 agility, but I've been saving all my stuff. I can't get to the fifth 
fourth or fifth floor right now, so I can't get these two mysterious pages, nor can I get the Ring of Endurance, which would be super sick. Got a bunch of uh, strange old lockpicks, which is super cool. Mother of Mine, of course, green that the other day. Rooftop Agility, of course. Chasing Armor, of course. We're not freaking losers. We'll go to the Slayer, with the Slayer one. We got the Flippers. We got the Brian Saber, the Leaf Bladed Sword. We got some boots. Miscellaneous. We got a lot in here. 17 out of 52. We got two curved bones literally yesterday. During the 1,000 kills that I got, uh, was doing Hill Giants, I got two curved bones. I don't know where this fresh crab claw is at. I have zero clue where I even got this. I don't even see it in my bank. I don't think I have it at my POH. I have no idea where it is. All the pets. Two tangle roots. That's where all my luck's gone, literally. That's literally where all of my luck's gone. Uh, so that's essentially where the drop log's at right now, guys. We're working on we're working on a lot of stuff kind of concurrently, but right now the, the main idea has been trying to just work on a bunch of this uh, bingo sheet and help out the team. You know, the squad's been pushing. I'll keep you all updated on that. Either way, that's kind of like a quick update. Um, huge shout out again to the clan, all the homies helping me out and pushing me to be able to go and do some new content in this game that I haven't even done before. It's been a lot of fun. You know, regardless if we win or lose this bingo event, I had a blast so far. And there's still about a week at the time of this recording that we're still able to go and grind out for a bunch of these bingo tiles. So hopefully we can get some lucky drops. We can get things happening and get some awesome bingos going. So that's really the main idea for these next few couple of weeks. Hopefully it all works out. Either way, huge shout out to all the homies again. If you're interested and would like to join their Discord, I'll leave a link in the description below. Everyone is super nice, super chill, and come in. They do a lot of really awesome events. And um, yeah, huge shout out to them as well. Really appreciate them. Uh, so yeah, that's about it for me right now, you guys. Hopefully you have a great time uh, a great time in the RuneScape worlds, the RuneScape realms. Get all those awesome lucky drops because you know that Herf Games isn't. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.